Welcome back to AFLP. We just got sucker punched by Dumb, and we're still playing the Wolf Among Us. But or the Wolf Among Us is playing us. We're not sure. It's true. Game still, as we said, kind of plays itself. But we're almost there. This should be the end of the first chapter. Soon, yeah. Well, we've got the whole thing with the, the trip crap. Yep, but that should only take one episode. You get to be a dick to more people. Remember, they, they should our, rename this game. Be a dick to people. The hey. dick among us. It's the it's <laughs> the whole among us porn parody. It sounds like it, yeah. <laughs> it's because you are a step behind. You probably couldn't hear that and it cracked his knuckles really loud. <laughs> Next time you do it, you should do it into the microphone. Yeah, maybe. Oh. I could pick a suspect, but I picked no one. Well, you're going to have to sit there feeling uncomfortable. I did it, but I'm not going to tell you that, so... Your silence left her unsure. I thought I already left Snow unsure. My job is not to make you feel sure about anything. And stuck in traffic simulator. My job is to not say anything and kick some ass. <laughs> I'm here bubble gum? to kick ass and chew bubblegum. Someone told me recently they watched They Live. It's a great movie. Oh my god. It's an amazing movie. It's held up really well, actually. What's it about? It's Roddy Roddy Piper, and he finds a pair of sunglasses... And when he puts on the glasses, he can see, like, the world's been invaded by aliens. What? And, like, all the, like, advertisements and stuff are subliminal messages. Like, obey and... That's crazy. Money, the, like, dollar bills say, like, this is your god. Like, worship this. So it's, like, this really... That's intense. <laughs> but it's John Carpenter, so he ends up, you know, killing a whole lot of people. <laughs> It's him and Keith David, and I think the thing this the movie is known for is like a twenty minute fight scene in an alley with Keith David and Rowdy Roddy Piper. It's known for a five second quote where he walks into well, the that, that, well that and the fight and the fight scene and the fight I scene. I am here to kick ass no. and chew bubble, bubble gum, gum and yeah. I am all out of bubble gum. And then he kills like ten people with a shotgun, but they're aliens, so it's okay. But also the fight scene, which you, if you have to watch anything, it's that fight scene because it's really funny because there's like no music, no like choreography, just the two of them like wailing on each other for 20 <laughs> minutes. And by the end, they're just like exhausted. So it's like Daredevil. And it's a little bit, <laughs> not, not nearly as like awesome or stylized, mm -hmm. but like they're punching each other and it's like, put on the sunglasses. Like that's the whole fight is you need to put on the glasses to see it. Because no, I'm not going to put on the glasses. And they just start beating each other up over it. And it's really funny. Put on the damn glasses. Oh, uh, great movie. Whatever happened to John Carpenter? Why doesn't he make awesome movies anymore? Give us your answer uh, in the comments after you've liked and subscribed. You know, be because people have been doing that. Oh no, wait, the other thing. Thanks <laughs> to those of you who have, because people still have YouTube accounts. It's the thing. I like that the silence option, I feel like it just should be glare. Because that's all he does, in silence. Okay. Into the bar. So, I don't know if you've, if you saw the... What it says under the trip trap? No. no. The, the sign is uh, three goats crossing the bridge. Oh. Huh. Uh, the trip Which trap. makes sense because of the trolls. Because yeah. because the troll runs the bar. Spoiler alert: she's a troll. And and not like the internet kind. <laughs> you should you should superimpose the picture of like the troll face over her face. That, let's not. Are you mad? No, that's copyrighted. No, it's not, is it? It is. What do you want, Sheriff? What do I want? None of your business. Oh. Well, I guess I'm not worthy of a 
Don't take it personally. No one's worthy of a response. <laughs> Be glad that I gave you this response as opposed to my fists. Obviously lying. You're your own woman. No, 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 she's not. I'm just gonna. She's her own it. troll. She's not her own woman. Well, she, she can be two things. Um, let's see, match black. Match black. Picture of Woody. Talk to Gran and no pickled eggs. Cigarette machine. Let's sit down and talk. I'm gonna buy some cigarettes. They keep up that smoke count. <laughs> yep. You got any change for this thing? No. Okay, I guess I'm not gonna buy any cigarettes. It's okay, you get cigarettes in another episode. You get cigarettes from everywhere. Okay, I think. No, but there's only actually one time where you pick them up. I think what I want to do is look at that picture. Because it's a picture of him. With her. I have to ask about it. Yeah, regular. I don't know who you're talking about. The one with the bald head and the beard. I've never seen him. You. <sighs> okay, fine. Uh. You gotta talk to him. Sit down on the bar. I like this one. So I'm just gonna stay silent and glare. You're gonna order something, or you just hit them on because of A little of both. Yes? Yes. You know what I mean. <laughs> oh, yeah, because he has no customs. Give me a line of gold. You want a line? I'm gonna say nothing and see what happens. Sit here quietly and wait for you to tell me things, because, you know, silence is the best option. Oh, someone in the bathroom. You lied to me. The restroom is for regulars and employees only. Tough shit. So there's a sign in the background that said used cat emporium. Nice. I think that's where Pixel went on to. Oh, yeah, it's a great callback. Never even thought of that. Pixel's in the used cat emporium? Yeah. <laughs> Would anybody really want to buy a used cat? Depends how used. <laughs> what what used, used, used for. <laughs> I could ask him if he was doing number one or number, number two. Number two, not that. Ask it. No, unfortunately, silence is our only option here. With this playthrough, we're making things silent. Whatever you say, Woody. He smiled. I <laughs> hope he's got the bandage on his skull. You really don't want to do this. Yeah, what's with the sign now? I think it was supposed to be like that before. They just made, made a mistake. Yeah? It's not like the alcohol has caused his glamour to have less effect. That would actually make sense. Oh, maybe. Or his glamour's wearing off because of the river cheapest. I don't think he has a glamour because you, you see he like... Transforms. Because he, tra he transforms, right? So he doesn't really have a glamour. Maybe the alcohol's making him angry. Or may maybe they do, and they can just go back and forth with them. I'm... Yeah. And he stays quiet. Oh, 
I love this. This is a neat little oh, yeah. Easter, Easter egg of what he's talking about here. So if that's not clear, he was talking about the, the, red, red, the yeah. red Riding Hood. going violent. So, he's not a troll. No. He's a something. Well, it's from, he's Grendel. He's, from, he's Grendel from like Beowulf. Beowulf. Oh! Uh, I couldn't figure out what it was. And she's a troll. I knew that. Oh, I guess we're into it. No? Okay. Did you fast with me? No, I did. Okay, tear the fan off the ceiling. Yeah, because you have to get angry first. You have to get damaged first. Well, that's the thing about him. He's nearly indestructible. He just had a slap. I don't think like I wolf out at all in this one. Oh, sure. maybe, maybe. Your eyes change. Well, a little bit. It's like in later episodes, like he shoot, like he goes like. So, are you gonna when you have the opportunity to choose? I feel like I last time I did this, and we didn't post this, but I'm probably gonna go with Woody because it's just so. No, 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 not that choice. Oh, oh, tearing off his arm. Yeah, absolutely. What? Absolutely gonna do that. Sorry, spoilers. We tear off his arm, but the, right. Always take the more violent option. Here we go. Partial, partial wolf. There's the wolf. Here we go. Yep, tear off his arm or walk away. It's a mess up part. Totally unnecessary. played through this game I tried to do it like not as a total dick yeah except I was like really pissed at this part so I tore off his arm and it was that's like, exactly what I did so it was yeah. like the one like dick move I made in the whole game and they kept throwing it back in my face because yep. I had nothing else to well, be like they, I, I played through it really nice and then I got to this point and there's some point where you're talking to the woodsman and um, I guess it's a different conversation it's it something like glass him and I thought that meant like Give, give him, him a glass. glass. No, and well, then you yeah, well, technically you do give yeah. him a glass. But then you take the glass and you smash it across his face. And I was like, oh, well, I guess I'm not the nice guy anymore. <laughs> I can pay for the pay drink. for the drink. 
No, I feel like being a total dick. I'm not even gonna pay for it. Don't run. Okay, so. Here we go. Glare at him. Oh no. You just walked into the wrong room. Okay, so. Should probably go after him. I know, it makes more sense to go after the Tweedle. But you get more of the story if you go after this one. It just, to me, it's so counterintuitive to go after the woodsman here. Is it timed? Oh, it is timed. That's why I'm going after the woodsman, because it makes less sense, in my opinion. Free beer tomorrow. Is it really? Because it'll never be. It'll I'm the fun. Eggman. <laughs> I'm cuckoo could you? So, is that the end of the? No. No, we're we're, we're not gonna cut off the episode here because there's only one little bit left. No, there's the Eggman diner, and now it's the Eggman diner. We saw an ad for it, and here we are. There's been like ten lost cat busters just. Like well, it's all the same cat. Well, I know. It's not but like there's so many. Ten different cats. This person really wants to cat. Ten different lost cats all named Pixel. <laughs> Do we have to find out what's down the witching well? Not in the games. Mm -hmm. Did they find the head? Oh, snap. Mondays. walks through. Hey, I'm technically police. Sort of. He's not, though. Totally the body. No, we've played this, haven't we? Yeah. You know what this is. <laughs> he's walking, that guy's running, and he's not caught up to him yet. Well, he's moving in slow motion. That's why he hasn't caught up to him yet. Oh, no! What a twist! Who murdered Snow White? Find out on the next amazing chapter of The Wolf Among Us! We are a trophy. Next time on The Wolf Among Us. Stuff that doesn't necessarily happen. Wait, does Snow White always die there? Yeah. I don't know why I thought she lasted longer. I knew she died. For some reason I thought she uh, died. Uh, no spoilers. <laughs> it was a head, so... Dun dun dun. Shut up, Crane. That doesn't ever occur. Well, there's another section, and I think it's in. The, at the end of the next episode, where there's like a whole subplot that I feel like was dropped from the game. Anyways, we'll see some of this maybe next time. And Toad never sees him as a wolf. Well, we do, again, there's a lot of stuff that's was dropped and changed, I feel like, in the yeah. development process. It's hard to tell. Yep. Anyways, uh, oh, let's take a look at our choices. Uh... You did not prevent Prince Lauren's death. Who's your prime suspect? Me and... Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you see most people arrested. Yeah. Because it makes more sense. Because they're looking for my All right, next time. All right, next time on AFLP.
Uh, we'll get back to more of the Wolf Among Us at some point. Thanks for watching.